If you hit me, <laughs> Krishan got on Twitter and said, I was giving him his flowers. He deserved them. <laughs> Bruh. They definitely do all this shit for attention. I wouldn't be surprised if, if Blueface were, all right, I'm ready to get on IG Live. I want you to scream at me. I want you to bust glass all through the house and throw some flowers at me in a glass vase. Like, I bet they be doing all this because they notice every time they on some negative shit, the blogs pick up on it. Everybody reposting it. Everybody commenting on it. And then you see Krishan on Zeus going crazy. It's all for show. It's all for them to get more attention because the more people tune in, the more money they're going to get on the next go around. It's all about viewership. It's all about drama. People don't want to see no reality show when all the girls going out, their best friends, they talking about positive stuff. No, they want to see broken, battered women coming from terrible backgrounds with an abusive boyfriend, getting drunk, and fighting. That's what sells. Sex and violence. So as long as people going to keep on reposting them, they not going to stop. Her ass screaming around the house, going in on him. He's standing right there just recording her. Like, come on, chill, chill. Any real man that got his own place and his girl going crazy, you kicking her out, you cutting her off. You want peace. You want quiet. You want somebody to make you happy, not stress you out every day. Especially if y'all not together for a financial reason, like y'all both broke, y'all need each other or a kid, what's the point of taking yourself through this toll every day? Blueface can get another chick, Chris Shaw can get another dude. So either they doing all this shit for publicity, or they both stupid. Maybe it's both though, if you ask me, which I think why this should be. It's like a trap.